hello everyone welcome back to my channel so first of all i'm extremely sorry for not uploading any recipes or any other videos i was actually very much absorbed with all my other projects so yes that's why a bit late but uh, yes let's uh, begin with this beautiful ocean theme raisin clock uh, I promised that uh, to bring this in my last video but due to some reason I wasn't wasn't well and of, of course I didn't get much time to edit the video so a bit late but yeah uh, today is the time uh, so for this uh, I have used 2 is to 1 ratio raisin and uh, how to mix the raisin and how to proceed I'll give you the in the description box below you will see another link for that video so first of all I have used a 14 inch diameter MDF board I have already colored that I have done a base color uh, of that base uh, sorry of that MDF board and I'll just I'm just drawing an outline where I would put the sand here I haven't used any silica gel I just used the normal sand from my flower pot so I have mixed some sand with resin and uh, just uh, spread it out with a spoon or a spatula in the uh, on the board and then it's up to you how you want to make the sand how you want to make a look I mean give a look to the beach so uh, the outline which I have drawn it makes me easier for the sand to spread out there so just follow the instructions or follow how I do this in the video and then you can definitely make it yourself so after this I'll just pour raisin of ocean colors raisin like light blue dark blue there are many other varieties of blue also but here I have used a light baby blue uh, raisin uh, blue color uh, this is a uh, alcoholic ink raisin color so I'll just blend with with my fingers so that it gives a real little realistic look because of the waves you will get uh, while, bl while blending the colors with the fingers you will just get a look of the waves so I'll pour I have pour a little clear raisin near the uh, sand portion near the beach and then I'll just after layer after layer I'll just try to give a darker shade of blue so that it gives a more uh, realistic look of a ocean so when it's done I'll just pour a line of white color over it so that it gives a depth of the waves so after you add the colors just blend it with uh, your fingers uh, and uh, it's up to you how to how you want to uh, get the colors correctly in the ocean theme clock so one mistake which I have done here is while uh, editing and while doing the videos somehow my last part of the video that is sticking the um, numbers and of the clock the file got corrupt and I couldn't add this but uh, yeah I have since I have the previous videos of the resin clocks you can the procedures are same just uh, follow those videos and then you can easily do it so after I have applied a line of white resin you can see that I am using a blower so that it gives the waves just keep dragging your blower slowly and uh, just remember don't burn your resin because if the blower is too high if you if the speed is too high it, there is a chance that you will burn your resin so one by one I'll just try to add a few more drops of white color so that it gives a beautiful wave uh, it creates a beautiful wave in the clock so this is how I have done so pouring some more clear resin over the top of the sand because it will give you exactly the effect of water after it dries up you can see that the clear resin gives as if the water is um, above the sand sticking out some pebbles and uh, shells 
these are normal uh, pebbles which I have collected and the uh, seashells I have been to some place where in, in near the sea and I have collected those. So these are all natural shells and pebbles. So if you, uh, if you have uh, any other options about this, you can definitely go for it. Yes, someone asked me if, if we can put aquarium uh, shells and pebbles. Yes, of course you can, you can. Yeah, there is no problem with that. And color, about the colors, you can go with any colors you want. If you are using acrylic color, you can also do that. So this is it guys and uh, uh, if you are new to my channel, please do like, share and subscribe. Your like and uh, and your, uh, if you subscribe to my channel, it will really help me a lot to grow. So yes, I missed out that video, uh, that portion of sticking the numbers. But yes, I will just drop down in the description box. Please do check that uh, video also. So thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Bye-bye.